from Zaki. Lesson from Zaki. Mom, Tosmaster Mohammed Zawa. Have all of them? Yes. Grow up. Act like an adult. No more fighting. My father has said this to me many times. Have you received such advice? Yeah. Yes. Contest chairs, follow friends. Good evening. Good evening. The first day of my secondary school was my first time in my life. I listened to his advice. So my first years passed without one fight. But then it happened. It was the day where the examination result were to be announced. I was in the class. And if you were with me, you would have seen me holding a paper like a stunned monkey holding his mobile bill. <laughs> and heard me saying, what, how, who? They must have printed the wrong name. <laughs> first class honor, <laughs> me? <laughs> For the first time in my life, I get an honor. I just could not believe it. Nor could my fellow student, Zeki, who came to me with an angry face streaming coming out of his ears like a boiling kettle. Hamad, you don't deserve it. I should be the first class honor, not a second. What would you do if someone said this to you? Do you know this type of criticism can destroy you? If you don't know how to turn it around, we need to be able to turn it around. And tonight I will share with you how I was able to turn it around. I left Zeki, but Zeki did not leave me alone. Have you ever met someone who has nothing left to do except criticizing you and make your life miserable? What did you do with that person? Dang it. Zeki started criticizing me every day, and I mean every day, from the minute I enter the class until the closing bell. An alternative ear to his criticism, and it's worked for a while, but one particular morning, I reached my breaking point, and I remember that day as vividly as I can see you now. Zeki was at me, at me, at me. You are not smart. Your English, awful. Your reading, awful. Your writing, awful. I lost it. I exploded like an interrupted volcano. I flew out of my chair, clinching my test, targeting his nose, ready to strike. Grow up. Act like an adult. And I heard in my, my, my head my father's voice. And they paralyzed me. I run from the class, gasping for air. What could I do? Return back to my old way and fight back? Or give up and have a peace of mind? While I was debating with myself, my eyes a glimpse Mr. Abbas, our economy teachers, who came over and saw my distress. And after I told him about my dilemma, he said something that I will never forget. With success comes distracted criticism. Focus in the facts, not in your feeling. And I left him with a smiling face, an adult. And that second year, my father hired an English tutor to help me with my English. And it's work. I get first honor again, but it was for all the second year classes. I just could not believe it. <coughs> Nor could my fellow student, Zeki, who came to me. Why are you so happy? Do you believe that you are better than me? I will beat you next year. And remember that he who laughed last, laughed longest. And I focus on the facts, not in my feeling. And as an adult, I studied hard for that third years, days and night. And while I was waiting for the final result to be published, I get a call from our neighbors, Abdel Manan, who works for a young newspaper, and he said, Congratulations, you will receive an award from His Royal Highness, Prince Mohammed bin Fahad, for being the first student in the Eastern Province. At that moment, I was the happiest person in the entire universe. And I grabbed the phone, can you get to go home? 
Thank you, yes, of course. I'm going to tell them I tolerate you for the best two years. You made me study hard. Days and night, it's my turn to laugh yet and then. Oh, act like an adult. And as an adult today, I realize if I had not met Zeki, and if I have not focused behind the fact of his criticism, I would not get this prestigious honors. Ladies and gentlemen, you might have met Zeki in your life, perhaps in your office, at schools, or even at your home. Maybe you have just a try to ignore their criticism because it's hurt. Maybe you just give up your dreams, your passions, when you are about one yard from the finish line before you touch the trophy of your success. But have you tried to learn from it? If you are willing to listen to the fact behind distractive criticism, you will open yourself to a new possibilities, just as I did. If you forget everything else <coughs> that, that I have said this evening, please remember this. With sexist comes distractive criticism, and within distractive criticism, line some facts, and within focusing in that facts comes a greater sexist. We will now remain silent for three hours, three minutes, while the test is complete.